All right, now I'm inside the main garden at Morgan's Farm in Cedar Grove. Uh, it started to rain, which sucks for me, but um, it's good for the plants. Gray days without rain don't really do much for anybody. So it might as well be raining. Let it come down. All right, but it, it's light enough. So, uh, all righty. So we see, pretty sure this is um, garlic. Might be doing some flowers this year too um, and some herbs but lots of greens over here he's got the some kind of peas that climb up these strings he's got set up his tomatoes he put in probably pretty recently or over there and he's got a cool system where I could run um, where instead of having the tomatoes be staked he's got strings with weights on the end of them and um he's got the system because he used to work for a metal fabricating company or he owned one actually um and these pieces were custom made i actually helped with putting some of these up uh a couple of years ago or a year ago and uh the tomatoes grow up this and that's their way of staking it and then, all right, to make this video quick, I'll jog. And it's like squash or somewhere. Um, here's some basil. A lot of kale. Maybe arugula, I'm not sure. But many different lettuces. Here's some pepper plants. And a lot more tomatoes. People love tomatoes around here. It's a heavily Italian area in Cedar Grove and Verona, which are most of the customers. And yeah, I guess I guess it's about an acre garden. I don't know, maybe it's a little bit less than an acre, but maybe like three quarters of an acre. But um, and he's got a little garden over there too. That one I can't break into, that's too difficult uh all right uh i'm gonna stop it here but um it's the right size this farm and it's got a lot of love a lot of high schoolers come here um and volunteer and some college students not far from montclair university or montclair high school and cedar grove high school of course is in the town and verona high school sends a lot of kids too um uh, at times so it's uh it's good john's open to all kinds of volunteers um, and all kinds of people come and get their food here and it's organic it's an organic farm um, and he doesn't use many chemicals and it's local so you get it fresh and it's just it's a better way to eat so yeah all right so say bye to Morgan's farm